Imagine this, a two-ton car that goes from zero to 60 in just two seconds, no engine roar, no gear shift clunk, just pure, eerie silence, and then a surge like you've never felt. This car isn't here to win the race, it's here to end it. This is the story of the motor that flipped the EV game on its head. Tesla didn't just make a better motor, they straight up reinvented it. A design so wild, so advanced, it's not just a flex, it's a warning shot to the entire auto industry. First time we caught a glimpse of this beast was back in June 2021 at the Model S Plaid delivery event. Elon's on stage holding this insane motor telling everyone, yeah, one person can lift it. Everyone thought, cool. But no one really knew what was under the hood. The secret? A carbon-wrapped copper rotor. Sounds simple, right? It's not. This thing runs so tight, so hot that regular motors would tear themselves apart. But this one? It holds steady. Over 20,000 RPM. Most motors tap out at 16K. This one's just getting warmed up. With ultra-thin air gaps, locked-in compression, and insane cooling, Tesla didn't just make a fast motor, they made the motor. And the Plaid? It's got three of them. That's 1,020 horsepower, 1,050 pound-feet of torque. And yeah, each motor's so compact and light, an engineer can literally carry it solo. Fast forward to 2025, Tesla's taken that same tech and made it cheap. Like, scary cheap. New drive unit? No rare earth metals, no overpriced silicon carbide, and the cost? Around $1,000 per unit. That's not just disruptive, that's a bomb dropped on the industry. But here's the wild part, it's not just fast, it's smart. EPA says it gets 348 miles of range with 101 mpg. And real-world tests? 300 miles on the highway, cruising at 70 mph. So, yeah, you don't have to pick between speed and range anymore, you get both. No compromises. And the rest of the industry? Still stuck in the past. Still building EVs off old gas platforms. No battery tech like Tesla. No motor, no scale. Lucid's fast, but pricey. Rivian's cool, but bleeding money. Ford and GM, pouring in billions, still fumbling with software and scaling production. Meanwhile, Tesla's not just building cars, they're building infrastructure, AI, and gigafactories all across the globe. China, Germany, the US India, Saudi Arabia. And the big brain behind all of this? Tesla's own AI supercomputer, Dojo. This monster trains itself on billions of miles of driving data. Every curve, every mistake, every camera feed, it learns. It adapts. It gets smarter by the day. So when you slam the pedal in a plaid and the car silently launches like a freaking spaceship, remember this isn't just a car, it's a statement. Tesla's shown the world. The future isn't just fast, it thinks. So the real question isn't who's gonna beat Tesla, it's is anyone even close?